Hi, I'm Tiddly Hahn, and this is my horse free garden. You won't find any horse DNA in this garden, just 100% pure tiddly. Now then, I'm going to start over there. My Philadelphus or mock orange needs a bit of a prune, and there are basically two types of wood on this. There are the shoots that start at the bottom and go up and up and up and up and up and up and up, and there are shoots which are branched. Now these are the older shoots, so I'm going to take out all the branched shoots right down to the bottom and just leave the single shoots. Branched one here. Ah. I've cut out all the older branched wood and left behind the newer single shoots. Looks slightly bare but it'll soon fill out. My next job is to tidy up this border in Soft Fruit City. I've got some rogue strawberry plants in it and I don't want my strawberry plants here because I want all my strawberry plants in Strawberry Patch 2.1. <laughs> Nice. I also want to tidy up this bed a little bit. The soil's really wet here. So much moisture. There's a lot of moss in here as well. It's so damp. Look at all this moss. <laughs> Carefully give it a light hoe, I think. God, it's like mud over here. Well, it's certainly looking a lot tidier, and there's some good news too. There are shoots on both of my pasque flowers. This is one I split last year, if you remember. So it looks like I'm going to have two pasque flowers this year. Good news. Most of the columbines that I transplanted last year seem to be doing okay. There are shoots on the sedum that I transplanted too. So on a good news scale of 1 to 10, that's probably a move. My last job of the day, today anyway, is just to rake this bed over, get up some of the moss and the other rubbish that's accumulated on here. That's a bit better. This tree's not really very good for hiding behind at the moment. Anyway, before I finish, why don't I take you round the garden and show you the signs of spring? That's all I've got time for this week. Thanks for watching and do join me next time in Titley's Busy Garden.